All right, today I'm going to show you how to connect to your Hestia control panel using FTP. So I'm using FileZilla here. I've connected to my uh, folder here with my, all my WordPress folders and files in here. You can create an FTP account in Hestia control panel through the web advanced options. So I'll show you how to do all of this. A few of you have been asking me how do you actually set this up and get it working. There's a few little tricks. So if all this sounds interesting, then keep watching. All right, so for this demo, I've got Ideasport XYZ set up here on Hestia on my Oracle free tier setup, and I've got WordPress running on here on Ideasport XYZ. What I want to do on this domain is add an FTP account. So we can go under web here in Hestia, we go to the pencil icon, and then we go to our advanced options. So we scroll down and you've got advanced options there. We scroll down and there's one called additional FTP accounts right at the bottom there. And we set up a username. So I'm going to call this um, uh, demo. So it'll create a user called Alex underscore demo, whatever your username is underscore whatever the FTP username is. So that'll be the, the way we log in and create a strong password there. Once you've filled those two things in there, go ahead and click save. That'll add the account to your panel. There we go. We've got uh, changes that have been saved there. Now we'll have to set up some ports for our FTP. So under your instance in Oracle Cloud, in this case, I'm going to go to my virtual cloud network there, then go to the subnet. So that's there. Click on the default security list, that one there. And then we're going to add ingress rules. So, and we want to fill this out as follows. So the source CIDR is 0.0.0.0 slash .0, .0, 0. And the destination port range is the important part. So we've got 20, 21, and 12,000 to 12,100. So that's a dash in the middle there. The description, I've just called that FTP. And then we add those ingress rules. And then it should look like this. You'll have all your Hestia default panel uh, ports there. And the three for FTP down here. So 20, 21, and 12,000 to 12,100. Now for this demo to connect by FTP, I'm going to use FileZilla. You can get that at FileZilla-project.org. And when we run FileZilla, it looks like this. We can create a new site. I'm going to create the new site here. There we go. We have to fill this out. So I've just filled this in. You put the IP address in there. Um, username in my case was Alex underscore demo and the password I used for my FTP setup. Now we can click connect. And we can choose to save passwords. If this is a, a private machine, you can do that. Otherwise, do not save passwords. You have to enter the password every time, but um, that's up to you. And this should connect just fine. Click OK there. And that actually looks all good. We can see we've got our FTP uh, folders here. We can go into public HTML. You can actually find the um, WordPress folders and files in here. For example, if you want to edit the WordPress config, you can go ahead and do that. But that is how to use FileZilla. So that is how you set up FTP in Hestia. Now, I should also note that Hestia has its own file manager there. If you don't want to bother, you can do most things manually through the file manager there. Um, you can decompress zip files as well. If you want to bulk upload a lot of files, uh, this, this one works fine as well. But there might be some software or hardware that you need to use an FTP for some reason. Um, so you can go ahead and do that. But um, file manager, it works fine as well. So um, I think that pretty much wraps it up. I'll link to the full tutorial if you want to set up Hestia. If you haven't done that already, check out that old video. But uh, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.